All right, guys, time for a little update. Uh, I want to show you what I got going on. I uh, converted my stock front end to this 1940 hot rod I'm building to a removable uh, one-piece front end. So let me show you how what I did with the, the Zeus fasteners. It's DZ, EU, so I don't know. Deuce fasteners. Anyway, let me show you what I got. So, <clears throat> right here is the fasteners. And you got springs that come with it. So you have these little fasteners. For the spring loaded, you press them in and turn them. And they're supposed to grab the, the springs. But uh, I, I wasn't happy with the way that was going to work. So what I wind up doing is taking and just cutting the cutting the end of it off and uh, so I can use just the the base and the spring and ran a bolt through it so this is the end result uh, so what we have is there, there was different uh, uh, spaces behind there and I just didn't feel confident with uh, with uh, just a spring holding that so basically what I did is I came in on the inside and welded a nut on the inside of the cab and ran the bolts through and got a washer and a uh, the spring underneath there with that base. So yeah, I got two on the hood on each side and uh, two on the uh, fender and skirting. And uh, so yeah, look, I like it, man. I think it looks pretty cool. Um, it bolts down solid. You know, with a, with a uh, little impact wrench, I can have this whole front clip off in less than a minute. I mean, just zip it off. You know, we got the... Uh, the front uh, uh, push bar, bumper, whatever you want to call it, all is one piece uh, to the front clip. But uh, yeah, it turned out good, man. I'm happy with it. Uh, you know, the gaps aren't perfect, but it's a 1940s. Had a tree, fell on the top and crushed the top. But but uh, but yeah, it's coming along good, man. Just wanted to give you a little sh short update uh, with the one piece uh, front clip. Hope you like it. And uh, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching Ozark Mountain Garage.